I rebelled um, mid twenties because I, I let it resurface. I buried I buried that for a long time, and then one day I was just like, you know what? Forget it. Hell, I was nineteen when I first got my pair of, first pair of earrings. You know what I'm saying? Seventeen when I first got my nails done. So I mean, I was grown in, but that that religion, you know, it kept me. As a little girl, I was always a little girl. I was never able to become a woman, you know? So I was still a little girl at 19. I was maybe 20, 29, and I brought the conversation back up, and my mother immediately apologized and was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. I didn't know that's all we gave you was church, 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 da 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 so I was like, you know, at that moment, I was like, okay, you know what? I ain't got to hold this no more. You know what I'm saying? We good. But my daddy, I ain't apologizing for nothing. Uh, da, 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 da. Immediately, I just, uh, yeah. Uh. So he stormed out one door. I stormed out another door. He went around the block. I went around the block. We met like here, and we just, he just had to be like, I didn't mean it that way. And you know what? Now I know. I didn't know then. But he came to me and he had to apologize because, and I had to accept it because he was responding from what he missed out on. I'm not the only one who missed out on something. He missed out on his life too. So it's like he didn't know how to respond. And so I get, I get it now, but you know, 